What it is, BHD, I'm Mr. Boy Blast from Sage D. Have you ever had a suck ass day where everything went wrong? Nothing went good. Your fucking car starts, you know, but then you realize that you don't have gas for the bitch. So then you sell your car to buy gas for your car, but then you realize now you don't have a car and gas doesn't sell for enough to buy a car. Nigga, shit is not lit. If I had that shit happen to you, man, just terrible stuff. Awful. I remember one time I went to my mailbox and these niggas sent me bills. It's fucking bills. And I go to 7 Eleven and try to cash a bitch. I can't cash a bill? What the fuck? <laughs> you, ever, you ever think about that shit though? Like bills are so expensive. Don't you wish you could cash them bitches? Like, you go in there and look at the bitch, $950. I really could use $950. <laughs> so today we're here to check out 16 hilarious Snapchats of people having a worse day than you. Because no matter how bad your day is, it's probably not going nowhere near as bad as someone else's. And that's real. Hmm? Bruh, this is immediately my favorite one, bruh. Look at this shit. Like, you look at this and it's bad. It's fucked. Like, there's no way that this can't be as bad as it looks. But then you read the fucking caption, yo. The caption makes this so much fucking funnier. Got a sandwich stuck in the vending machine. Bought a drink to push the sandwich. Damn. Like, how bad does your luck have to be? And why the fuck are they selling these long ass sandwiches in the fucking vending machine? My nigga, that looks like a big ass fucking piece of bread. That don't look like it got any meat or anything on it. Just fucking bread. It's a good selection of juice though. That that looks like, what's that, what's that, fruit juice? That shit look mad delicious. What do you do? You know what I mean? I had this shit happen to me a couple times, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, nigga, I just look both ways like I'm about to cross the street and then start physically assaulting the fuck out of the machine and start rattling it trying to get your shit. Nigga, the shit that fuck with me is when this shit happens with arcade machines. You ever go to an arcade and put your fucking, your quarters into an arcade or your tokens inside the fucking little slot shit? And then like, but you don't get a credit? You know what I mean? Like, legitimately, I look both ways. I'm about to cross the street, take a couple steps back, and fucking just kick the shit out of the fucking arcade machine where the coin slot is. It works. It's like a 12% success rate. You know, but it's a lot better than a 0% success rate if you never kick the fuck out of it in the first place. Oh, number two. This is what defeat looks like. Okay, is this blood or spaghetti? I love how the cat is like legit trying to help her though. Like look at him over there trying to lick up the spaghetti, like trying to help clean. And look, boo, look at this, look at this chick's face. She looks like she's crying. This looks like spaghetti sauce. It's, and everyone knows that you always make the noodles first before you make the spaghetti sauce. So now you've got a bunch of spaghetti noodles and no motherfucking spaghetti sauce to go with the shit. Huh? Your ass about to eat struggle spaghetti. Huh? Better put some mayonnaise on that shit. <laughs> we don't waste food. Dead ass spent two hours doing project on youth in Asia then find out it's supposed to be on euthanasia oh euthanasia <laughs> youth in Asia <laughs> I just got that no youth in Asia he spent two hours doing the project for youth in Asia and only to find out it's supposed to be euthanasia nigga you can't <laughs> You can't tell me that that would not be the most depressing shit in the goddamn world, man. That's too fucking funny. No, this has to be a joke. No. Work perks, right? You look at the you want the one on the left. It says work perks. Yeah, somebody sent me a small chocolate cake. Nigga, turn up. And then a couple of seconds later, she posts the fucking Snapchat with the bite out of it like, turns out it's a bar of soap. <laughs> bitch, 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 it's a, it's a chocolate cake soap. <laughs> look, look at how big the bite is. <laughs> oh, 
Oh my god, how mad, bro? I would be so salty. Some shit like that happening just lets you know life just ain't worth living. It's like, have you ever had it happen where you've got that like whack ass taste in your mouth and you're just you're, you want to you want some sugar taste, right? You want sugar taste in your mouth and shit is whack. Like day is boring and shit, and then you get a random piece of candy. It's like, oh my god, like I'm about to kill the bad taste in my mouth and shit, man, and it's about to spark up my life a little bit. You bite into it and you realize, nigga, it's black licorice. Like, or, or coconut. You know what I'm saying? Like one of those candies that's basically fucking a, a practical joke or a prank. It's not candy. Black licorice ain't candy. It's like biting into a Twinkie, but someone replaced the middle with jalapeno peppers. Like, nigga, this is, this is not funny. Buy the hell a slice off the top layer, layer, wrap that bitch in more plastic, and go give it to someone else. Man, they, 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 they gave it out chocolate cake candy. Here you go, bro. Good luck. Yeah, eat it. Eat it. Okay, so number five, there's a hot guy at the office. Help? What the fuck? Oh, God, the flash was on. Abort mission. Abort mission. Oh, my God. No. No! That's like seeing a bad chick, right, running up on her and trying to inconspicuously take an ass shot or like a vagina or like a picture of her pussy, but the flash goes, like the flash goes off. What do you do? Now she knows you just Snapchatted her, her own pussy. What lie do you say? <laughs> oh no, I, I, nigga, I would immediately go blind. What the fuck were you doing? What? Huh? Abort mission. Nigga, this is like the funniest Snapchat shit I've ever seen in my goddamn life. Abort mission. Looks like someone put too much soap in the washing machine. The entire house. God damn. Nigga, I thought that there, I thought that it just snowed on their house. And their only house was the one that got snow on it. How much soap do you put in the washing machine to flood this bad? What were you doing? the fuck were you watching? Humans? Fuck a shower. I'm gonna hop in the machine and put this shit on spin cycle and delicate, cause I'm soft, and then just fill the bitch with fucking washing powder. Like what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Tried to take a photo of my ice cream. Got photo bobbed by a seagull. Eating my ice and bro was fucked up is nigga, not only does he have the delicious looking cone, but that's that dis delicious extracurricular looking ass fucking ice cream, bro. Like it looking like it's got like caramel and chocolate and fucking all of that shit in there. And the seagull just gonna be like, up, oh, up, oh, mine. Bro, I'll fight a seagull. Damn that, bro. I'll fight the, I'll fight the fuck out of this bird. i lose too, i lose. But I'll fight the fuck out of this bird. Nigga, you I uppercut this goddamn bird right in his fucking throat. I grab his mouth and fucking and squeeze his stomach and force him to give me my ice cream back and then eat it. <laughs> <laughs> ice cream is serious, yo. My calculations were incorrect. This one's not that bad. Nowhere near as fucked up as the other ones. He just lost his kid. But this is the soft stuff. The soft foam shit. So it should be fine. No! Okay, no, my bad. Okay, when I first saw this just now, I thought that this was like the lottery. I thought it was a lottery picking because it was 138, 141. I figured they skipped him on the lottery. Like he was about to win some shit. But it's just his order. This is fucking sad. It's pretty sad. Nowhere near as bad as the other ones, but it's fucking sad. In the janitor's defense, he did put the soap in the soap dispenser. No one is this stupid. You gotta be kidding me. At least put some water in there. You know what I mean? And like shake it up a bit so you get like some soap water, nigga. Like, word. He just don't want people to wash their asses or their hands. Why would you wash your ass in a hand soap dispenser? I don't. We gonna edit that out. That never happened. It didn't happen. There are bad days at work. And then there's this man's day. Oh my God, that is fucked. How long is it gonna take him? to clean up all of these fucking eggs, man. You can't even eat the eggs either, man, because they've got broken shells in them. Who fucks up and drops that big of a fucking amount of eggs at an egg dispensary? Like, how do you, how do you fuck that up? This is actually fucking funny. 
Like this is not that bad, especially not as bad as the other ones we've seen, but I can see this being, being a bit frustrating. <laughs> oh God, it's the little things in life that let you know the life sometimes isn't worth living. <laughs> like losing the frosting on your cake to the cake box. <laughs> oh no! I don't think they thought out their engagement photo. Nigga, anal. That's how you know it's real love. You know? They are gonna they're gonna get married and holy matrimony and look each other in their eyes and you know and and, and say their vows to one another. You know, then they're gonna go home and and hold each other ever so gently and firmly at the same exact time. Look deeply into each other's eyes and then do it in the butt. Because they love anal. Apparently I've been basing my love and my relationships off the wrong thing. Maybe that's why they keep failing. I tell the next girl I date, hey, you in the butt stuff? No. You gonna learn today. You know what I mean? Spread it! <laughs> Spread it! <laughs> that, that's, that sounds bad. We're gonna edit that out. No! You're killing him! Really? I don't think you're walking your dog right, sir. <laughs> it's just true. I, at first glance at this photo, I thought that was a fish. I thought he had caught a fucking fish, but didn't know he caught a fish and was dragging it home. That is fucking awesome. That is terrible. Grandma got bit by a pelican on the pier and then began to scold it. Oh, the pelican looks like it feels bad for doing it. You you know what, you're right. I, I don't know what I was doing. I'm really sorry about it. I hope we can be friends. I'm really sorry about this. The lady's like, no, you know what? And you know what, let me tell you another thing. Mr. Bird, okay? You just go around tasting people, all right? I am a God-fearing woman, okay? You treat me with some goddamn respect, okay? Now you get your bird ass over there, you think about what you did, all right? I won't tolerate your shit, bird. You know, the bird just, you smell like fish, bitch. What did I was supposed to think? I thought you were a big fish. You stink, I'm sorry. Today was the first time I did my laundry. It did not go well. What the fuck did you put in the fucking laundry? Gasoline, nigga? You can I see it now. This nigga's like, this nigga's like sees the soap this bridge and sees the thing you're supposed to pour the soap in and poured like gasoline in that bitch. Word? <laughs> no, my clothes said to be washed on hot. You know what I mean? I just figured the water was obviously not gonna be warm enough. I just made sure it was really hot too hot, and now we live in we we live in a bus stop. We are homeless. I don't. It was. I think I I think I fucked that shit up. <laughs> but yo, hope you guys enjoyed the video. This has been Snapchats showing you guys that some people's days are far worse than yours. You feel me? But uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Super Blast from Sage D. Twizzles. <laughs>